Are you? Hey, how are y'all doing today? Good, good, good. Just let me know when you're ready. Ready? My name is Cheryl Scott, S H E R R Y L, Scott, S C O T T, and I oversee the Crimes Against Persons Division. I'm here today to ask for the public's assistance in identifying the suspect responsible for the murder of 37-year-old Yabancia Ibera on May 11, 2013, between the hours of 10 o'clock and 11 o'clock p.m., Mr. Ibera became involved in an altercation in the 9400 block of El Centro in the ne northwest area of Dallas. During the altercation, he was pushed to the pavement where he struck his head. On May 20th, 2013, Mr. Ibera died. His death was ruled a murder by blunt force trauma. The offense occurred near two large retail businesses, Walmart and Sam's. Therefore, we believe that there may be other witnesses to this altercation. The suspect to, believed to be a Hispanic male about 30 years old 5'10", 180 pounds. The suspect may have fled in a dark col colored Honda. Oak Marks is often, Oak Mark, <laughs> Oak Farms is offering a $10,000 reward for information leading to the arrest and indictment of the suspect. Anyone with information is asked to call the Dallas Police Homicide Unit at 214-671-3693. The reward offer will remain in force for six months. Chief, uh, oh, yeah. okay. Chief, yes. is this a, a road rage murder? We do not know, and that's why we're looking for witnesses. What do you know of that happened? We have talked to a few witnesses and they observed the altercation, a fight in the street. They observed the uh, suspect hit our complainant and the complainant fall and the suspect kicked and punched the complainant. And that's as much as we know. Um, Mr. Ibarra had uh, some prison history. Do you think this is in any way related to his previous drug convictions, or you think that there was nothing nefarious about his life that caused this? Um, we cannot say, but that's why we need to help the public to give us that information. All we have is the altercation, what the witnesses saw. Uh, we were told by his mom that uh, someone took a license plate number, but it may have been wrong. That's correct. Do you guys have a system where if there's a number or a letter off that you guys can kind of play with it? you know, to get at least close to the make or color? Yes, we do, but we were not very uh, successful in finding that um, Honda. Any video been helpful? Any surveillance video from the stores or people who may have shot video of the fight? Uh, we, the, we do not have any video of the actual altercation. You want somebody to provide that if they have it. We understand there are many people with their phones up. Um, I have uh, no information about people filming this with their phone, but I sure hope there were because we sure could use that information. I need to make a correction that was 10 o'clock a.m. and not p.m. Could it have been that people didn't realize that this gentleman died and why they might not have stepped forward? We talked to us about that, that it, he was in the hospital for a long time. And if there were a lot of people out and saw it, they might have just thought it was a fight. But now that he died, that might take it to another level. That, that's absolutely right. That could have been the case where they may think, uh, the witnesses may have thought it was just the assault that took place and that this, uh, our victim was okay. But in fact, he was not, he did die. 
And he was never conscious or able to speak to anyone about what happened? Not in order to tell us um, exactly what happened. Can you repeat the reward again? I mean, in the South by form, I mean, that may get people who still have the video to come forth with it. Okay. Um, Oak Farms is offering a $10,000 reward for the information leading to the arrest and the indictment of the suspect. Anyone with information is asked to call Dallas Police Homicide at 214-671-3693. This might be a, a crazy question, Chief, and if it is, forgive me. There was a $5,000 reward by Crime Stoppers. This is 10000 by the dairy. Is it 15000 total or is it 10000 One ten thousand. That That is correct, a total of $15,000. And I want to reiterate that this um, award is only, or this reward is only in effect for six months. One last crazy question. What should people do if they see a fight? I mean, if people have phones out shooting at the and this might be a silly question, but what should people do if they see a crime being committed? If they see a crime being committed, they need to call 911 because you never know what the outcome will be of that crime. Hold on a second. Is there anyone available to speak about bikers shutting down the Okay, I can't talk to that. That okay. will have to be somebody else. Paul will take care of that.